I was in 10th grade. In what, 6th grade? I was 15. I was 17. In 8th grade, I believe. For Christmas, when I turned 19. In 5th grade. I think I was 14. When I was a freshman in high school. My 13th birthday. My freshman year. About 14 years old. 8? No, 16 years old. I think it was right after my 17th birthday. I was about 12. I was 15. In 9th grade. Maybe 15. Actually 19 years old. It was just the greatest thing ever. I was like the happiest person ever. It was, it was, it was definitely very exciting. My whole world was opened up. The top two gifts I've ever gotten in my life were my dog and my iPhone. It was, it was life changing. And I was super excited because I could finally um, text. I was so excited. I had to text all my friends right away. And I was lit. And I was so excited. Um, because I, all my friends had um, all the all the technologies with all the Instagram and the Snapchat and Facebook and stuff, and I was super excited to be connected with them. Um, I was super excited. I texted all my friends, obviously, right away, like, guess what I got? Super cool! But I was super excited because I finally turned my dad. It just felt like I was so included and in that I was a part of something some social trend and I felt included and I could talk about these things in a social setting and I felt like cool almost because like I belonged. This is the best thing that could ever happen to me. And I wanted to have it on me all the time and I wanted to show it off and I wanted to walk around town talking to people on my phone. <laughs> and yeah, I just felt really, really excited. Yeah. <laughs> I was just very, very happy. I wanted one, I think, mostly because everyone else had one. That was one of the biggest things. I could relate to everyone else's experience and make sure that I was connected. And, yeah. Was I could play game, video games on it. I played Fruit Ninja all the time. Because then you could download so many different apps, um, especially the texting apps. That was that was insane. That was awesome. <laughs> All my other friends, they had cell phones when they were like in 8th grade and 7th grade even and so I was like, I was always the kid I was missing out, you know? It was just like this opening that I felt like I was more included with everybody because I was older when I got one, so I didn't feel like I was a part of the loop as much, um, even though I still had access to all of the same stuff using an Apple product, it just wasn't the same since it wasn't cohesive. That's usually the coolest girl or guy in the class is the kid who has the cell phone when he's in sixth grade. He does all kinds of cool stuff. He can play video games on. Nobody else in my friend group really had one, so I felt like, you know, I have this. And it was also a really great way to connect online because a lot of my connections are through social media. Well, a main reason that I wanted one was because everyone else was getting one and it was like the new thing, you know, kind of to fit in, honestly. Like, I use my iPod, you know, all the time for everything. I always have my iPod with me, so I could only use it if I was in certain places, which, you know, like in the car, or if you didn't have a Wi-Fi password, you could never use it. And then, so you, you were just like sitting there like, oh, wanting to use it so bad, but you couldn't. So then this way, it's like, you can have all that, but there's also a service, so you can do everything you want on it. And I remember this really cool girl had an iPhone ever since she was like in sixth grade or something. And everyone around me had like the new iPhone 3 or whatever it was. And I'm like, I need a phone like that or that phone like immediately just so I can be in the loop with everyone. And I wanted one so bad and I would just pressure my mom over and over again like, I kind of need this phone. <laughs> and she would always be like, why you have this slide phone? I'm like, it's not the same. I saved up a bunch of money and bought it myself and I was so excited. I think that independence came along with driver's license and a smartphone. I felt like accomplished because I had bought something on my own. Uh, I bought it myself and so I was really proud of that accomplishment. It was like being away from your parents, you got to do whatever you want. Um, they didn't look at your internet history, they didn't look, they weren't monitoring, or at least my parents weren't. <laughs>